Here we go. Through a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How did our world come to be? The old ones perished a thousand years ago, triggering the extinction of all life. She showed me how it was reborn. A little outcast girl, ignorant of her own importance. Through her, I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero Dawn. A terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. And with her, I learned the deepest secret of them all. The secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator. Born to prevent a new extinction. Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI. Given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me. She prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. But as useful as she has been, now... I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. Oh, I hope he doesn't screw us over again. Okay, that was just the intro. Okay, uh, that caught us up on everything. Okay, this is the new stuff. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> oh, I hope we get to ride one of those this time. It's fine if we don't, but it would be so cool. Running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, we'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. But every time I think I have a lead... ...it comes to nothing. She's wearing the, uh... And every night, I have the same dream. The best armor in the last game. Oh, it looks so good. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me. Man, they really Even upped it. Even though you've it. been 
dead for a thousand years. Like the details on the faces. Holy crap. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. That's right, that's a charm she found. And for a moment, I Last feel game. whole. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. I wonder if that's a locket or a charm. Beard. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. Look how you nice he looks. I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So. What are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the blight. Both, actually, but, um, I should- Oh, no. I've been dragging you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you. No matter what, you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Yay, we got friends. <laughs> okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> An extra focus? A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Holy um, crap! I'll have to explain everything as we go. Our facility restricted access. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. So freaking cool. This is like when your extrovert friend tries to get your introverted self out to places or just to hang out in general. Shall we? Uh huh, uh huh. Grapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Okay, These okay. Don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. Give me a second. The focus helps you see the ones we need. Oh, give there. me a second. Those plants by the stream should do the trick. Oh. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. Okay. Okay. These ones? 
Uh oh, they changed the color of the plants that heal you. You can store limited number of medicinal berries in your medicine pouch. It's berries now. Before it was flowers. Tap once to heal using the medicinal berries from your medicine pouch. Ugh. Bitter? Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. After I collect every I patch of berries. Plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. Jumping works good. Let's see. Uh, oh, I don't have any rich wood. <coughs> this stuff spreads fast. Six months ago, the land was fine. Now it's everywhere. Not good. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. Whoa! That's quite far away. Down. What are we after exactly? The backup? Well, um, it's an AI. It's um, it's hard to explain. Think of it like a set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. I don't know how to put these ropes here, but we can use the line to slide down. We noticed your uh, traveling light these days. Farrell? Oh, he's coming. Yeah, I um, ran into some trouble on the way here. Lost a lot of my gear. I wonder what we have. Uh, what weapon is this actually? Oh, just it's, it's just a hunter bow. Yeah. Look there, more of the blight. Yeah. I just touched with slimy. Ooh. I'll take your word for it. So it's not just trying to consume the land now, it's trying to poison it. Salvaging machine carcasses as usual. And there they Looks like they left a carcass behind. Right there. I still don't got no ridge wood though. I'm gonna need to get some arrows. Oh, Ooh, here we go. In that machine. Better take a closer look. Grab some of these though. Let's see. There we go. Ooh. Whoa, humans took this down. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come? I don't know. But good thing we have some arrows of our own. Might be trouble up ahead. Okay. It's so weird being completely out of Ridgewood considering I had way too much last game. <laughs> okay. There's a ladder. But can't reach it from here. Nothing a well-placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. After you. Thank you. By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission... The, uh... We need to find a way in. So, um, what happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. Fox. You're right about that. The blight's not just poisoning plants. It's killing animals, too. Then people will get sick, too. And starve. Yeah. We're not gonna let that happen. This is very different from some of the attacks that happened before. On a very different level. I wonder. I wonder. Ah! 
<laughs> Words are difficult. I wonder if that means that it's a different one of uh, different one of AI, uh, Gaia's AIs that's attacking us. Oh, I'm still hurt a little bit. There we go. Down this way. Again, it doesn't hurt to be stocked up on most of everything. Get to the grass. Is that a watcher? Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Most dead machines have it all alert. That's a freaking Pokemon. The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Scan the machines with your focus to highlight weak points and patrol paths. Pull to activate the focus mode. Give it a second. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Okay. Use left or right on the D-pad to scroll through machine components. It's I. It's a weak spot. Right. Ooh. I like that. Ooh, I like that a lot. It's a lot more detailed than before. Okay, it shows possible loot and everything and in a way that is easy to read. Okay, it's weak to fire damage. Of course, I don't have any. And it says what cauldron unlocks the override for it. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's a burrower, a common recon machine. Okay, attack mobile destroyed when killed. Key upgrade resource. Contains valuable resources. I'm ready. Okay, concentrate. Are you kidding me? Okay, good. We have concentration. Another one's coming. <laughs> Focus know all that. It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. Um, or you could just say magic. So after the fuss, magic seems to understand. What did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. The Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. I set out to find you. <laughs> Another ladder. I need to shoot off the lock. Crap, I hope that's not a sign. Freaking missing my shots. Uh, I'm interested. Okay, let's take a look. We have the normal spear. Damage. Ooh, we have stats now. Okay, nice. Nora anointed armor. So it's not the same armor that we had before. Well, made armor made of repurposed technology from an ancient lab. After losing its power source, it was modified to augment ranged combat. Ah, okay, so it is, but it's been damaged in some way. Cool. I mean, not cool. That sucks that that happened to it, but still. Okay, skills. Whoa. Okay, warrior, trapper, hunter, survivor, infiltrator, and machine master. Lots of different skill sets, it looks. Increases ranged. Ooh. Very different. Okay, we'll focus more on this when we actually get uh, a skill point to interact with that. The map looks nice. Looks like before with the smaller areas where it's more detailed. Ooh. Halo is just standing there. That's cool. Aaron's jobs. Active main, right? And then of course our notebook. Character bios. Travel. 
Travis Tate, Silence Rost, Ted Farrow. Fuck that guy. Uh, Travis Tate. Oh my gosh, that was that guy. Okay, yeah, he uh he worked on the program program with Elizabeth. Forgot about that guy. <laughs> he had like a a southern drawl, if I remember. Okay, sprinting, sliding. Uh, that stuff is pretty much same. Campfires fast travel. Visit campfires frequently to save your progress. You can also fast travel from a campfire for free. Okay, so that is now just you can fast travel. You don't need a fast travel pack. Shelters allow you to craft upgrade items at a workbench, save your game, or change the time of day. <gasps> Ooh. Boss battle autosave fast travel. If you feel underpowered during a boss fight, you can load a save file labeled boss battle autosave via the options menu. Quest start autosave. <gasps> okay, okay. Lots of cool stuff that can help us. I'm sorry. I just want to make sure we have... I know the basics of the game, so I don't need to read through all that. Someone um, this machine too. So someone definitely went through here before us. Oh, I'm so excited. Yeah, found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. That's good to have extras. Yeah, especially when an evil bastard named Helis decides to, you know, break yours. I wonder what this facility is, though. Texas. We'll be okay, Lower ladder. Ooh. Shortcut in case we die. <laughs> Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them. Uh, let's see if our credentials match. Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you. Dr. Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. That's not good. Well, let's find a way in. Please hold Am for I identity scan. A Access denied. Credentials not recognized. Oh, I guess it doesn't like me either. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I, I didn't know he was going to try it too. Um, I still, I'm still wondering if Ted Farrow had like anything to mess up with Gaia Should be more than this open. already did with like the learning part. Oh. I love the PS5 controller. Yes, someone dropped in from above. The haptic controller with like the Whoever sense of triggers. Awesome. Have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Probably dead. A lot of the times, people who get to areas before oh, us usually are what's dead. That stench. Entire camp wiped out. They must have come here to delve for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. Oh crap. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. Not through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Metal clamp. Circle support can be dislodged with pulling force. Oh, so we just gotta grab it. Let's check the camp real quick, see if there's anything left. Some more chill water, cool. Ooh, a training dummy. Hiya! Oh, we can charge the strong attack now? Oh, I love that! The melee attacks are so much more fluid. Haha, 
<laughs> we are victorious over this. Uh, what does this read? I don't... Oh. Don't know what that says. Just making sure there was anything else left here besides that supply cache. Ooh. There's a workbench over there. Didn't the uh, information at the beginning mention something about a workbench? Flat working surface with assorted tools can be used to upgrade gear. I guess I don't have anything to upgrade yet. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. Oh. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. Huh, a hook arrow. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. Let me guess, the workbench. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Oh, something else I missed Poor over here. Guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Part of a machine. Could help fix the gears. Okay. Oh, looks like I missed something over here, too. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. Yeah, I kind of figured. Let's see how this works. Okay, pull caster, special gear, legendary, an improved version of the De Delver's prototype tool that can latch onto and pull objects. Also enables grappling to specific points. Ooh, I wonder if we can use this to pull off machine parts. Excellent. Uh, do I have special gear? Unknown gear. Okay, so no, I don't. There. Give it a try. Uh, pull caster. Now to test it on the debris. Okay, the pull caster is a versatile two. The t two. It's a two, a tool that allows you to manipulate objects in the environment that have a grated pattern. Okay. To wield the pull caster. Hold L2 and tap triangle. Okay. Here we go. Ooh. That worked better than I thought. Sorry about that. <laughs> Doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. Uh, I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Huh. Data console. What's this thing for? We will find What's out. This? What's this? What's this? There's color everywhere. Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Guess we'll find out. Possible bad guy. 
anything else left in this area? This didn't turn up much. I better scan. I was more or less just hoping to see if there was any not yet items but scanning the area with my focus activated might show me something let's just go through here um or not of course when I meant go through here I meant go up here yes this was definitely oh wait wait, wait. can I use the pole caster my, my new toy? I activate my focus. Scan the area. Uh... No. Okay. Oh, I might be able to get up there. Use... You can grapple this with one to jump and tap X to grapple points. Oh, okay. That's how that wow. works. That works. That pull caster's useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Let's be helpful. Do, 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 do. Huh, okay, to use grapple point, get within range, quickly tap X while in the air. Wasn't anything in there, right? Oh, this is gonna be fun. I feel like a lot of games nowadays are adding like a Spider-Man function for you to be able to quickly traverse areas. <laughs> I love it. Okay, tap X while sprinting will form a long jump. Oh, skill. Your jump still scare me, Aloy. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. Ah. Ooh. Um. Can I grab items? I can! Holy crap! That's awesome! Oh man, that's another thing I need to look out for. Hey, ancient ring. Nice. There you go, bro. Thanks. Alright, what about the door? Oh, that's pretty. Humans, Homo sapiens, us. Yes. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. The serious system. No way, did that, someone actually escape her? Earth will create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it. But when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. The playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. I remember hearing about a crash, uh, a, a ship, the spaceship they was a backup plan to Horizon Zero Dawn, blowing up, but I, I forgot it was called the Odyssey. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Terraforming a new planet. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? 
Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? Ugh. We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. They just didn't know how. Yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. No, they died. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. In the end, it didn't matter if you were rich or poor. All humans died in the end. Thanks to the corruption. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Uh. Wait. That was a secret. I, I had a secret the there. Ones could fly. They were capable of a lot of things. For good and bad. Yeah. Sure seems like it. I wonder what it's like up there. Among the stars. Show off. <laughs> Wrong. Is that an onion? Machine muscle. Oh, okay. Uh, should I use the wilds? Focus really might be able to help place. here. I should be able to pull that thing out of the wall. Okay. Right, hold it. There we go. Deeper into the creepy ruin we go. <laughs> what? What is that? Keep your guard up. Oh, my guard is up. And I am terrified. <coughs> Ooh. Poison. Up here. More little guys. Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. I can be stealthy. Moving off. I need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. Okay. There's its patrol path. Gotta get closer. Sight. I can throw a rock to distract it. Get it into a position where I can sneak up and strike. Just have to wait for the right moment. Okay. Does that work? How does that work now? Time Tap. to throw. Ah, okay. It. 
turned the wrong way. Thanks, Varl. My rock. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, hi! You're right there now. Hi. Okay. Probably more ahead. Yeah. More of those machines ahead. Nothing you I can't handle. Tag him. Any other ones? Just the two? Okay, just the two. Oop, let me grab those parts since Sparl doesn't seem interested in them. On your lead. Yay, fine. Uh, where's a quick way into some grass? Gonna have to get used to like toggling the focus. Can I follow? No, only one, only one path at a time. Okay, it's one. That wasn't the... I was hoping it was going to be farther. Dang it. here goes back down does its little search I was gonna come back this way and when it loops around that's when we'll strike this is probably the cutest machine we've seen it, it's basically a giant squirrel mongoose thing. Are we clear? Oh no, there must be more ahead. Yeah, there's. I've been meaning to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. <laughs> Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry my whiskers offend you, anointed. Why, why, why you don't like the beard, Aloy? 
He looks great. I don't understand. The light's made its way in here, too. Looks like this little guy got caught up in the blight. Why does this thing Can't hate escape. boxes? I hope it didn't suffer long. Well, rest in peace, little fox. Oh, oh that is a that is a thing I cannot walk over. Um Excuse me? This seems like a sign of life. It's not like machines to leave fires, you know. The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Yeah, before being drowned in acid. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. Ooh. Keep this for later. Help potion. Guess Sweet. that Osram didn't have a chance to use it. You received a small, small health potion. Health potions take time to drink, but refill your health instantly and can overheal. Excuse me, past your max health. Past your max health? Careful. Traps ahead. Huh. You might be able to disarm them. Last trap. To dismantle traps, approach them carefully and hold triangle. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. And not blow yourself up. Very Dismantled good. it. And got more supplies. So, do we have blast traps now? No. No, I do not. <laughs> Looks like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. Ooh. To craft blast trap, hold down and open your hunter's kit. I can use this. Oh, uh, I don't have the right supplies Ooh, to craft a trap. Interesting. But it looks like the Osram shot off some machine parts. I might be able to scrounge up enough materials from them. I like this. There's a quick crafting menu. Okay, probably need more of those other parts over there. Die! No. Death to all training dummies. Should have what I need to craft a trap. Okay. Uh. There. Explosive trap made. If anything walks into one of those, it won't know what hit it. Two ought to do it, I guess. Over here, Aloy. I think I see a way up. Ah. Awesome. I mean, we have rope. Can't we just... Machine's head. Don't think they spotted us. I've seen this machine before. A scrounger. That's new to me. Let's oh. see where its weak points are. How was he able to... Maybe we could place one of those traps you made in its path. to go around again before I place the trap. If I remember properly, these bigger ones can't just be silent strike killed. So...
Okay, hopefully the balloon isn't too obvious. <laughs> Let's see. Varl, get back here. Varl, 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 Varl. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Now we just sit here patiently and wait for this thing to be blown the heck up. Big hunk of metal. Get over here. Let's see the blast radius. How big is it? Not bad. But pretty much just like very. Not a very big AoE. me out the window. We're clear. Damn thing. Owie. Let's keep going then. <laughs> Freaking hurt. <laughs> Good grief. You've been in a lot of old world ruins. Are they all like this? They all have their secrets, but... Every place is different. Oh, speaking of secrets. Eh. More syllables. Okay, what can I jump on? Easy. That's a big storm picking up out there. Yeah. And they're getting stronger. And more frequent. Oh boy. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah. But I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We'll need to cut through that big building on the right out there. Let's see. Blah, blah, blah. Stuff, stuff, stuff. Okay, through What's that door. Here? Aloy, come check this out. What is this thing? Hmm. Huh. Text log. This data mentions the tech that Far Zenith traded with Zero Dawn. It doesn't explain how they got it back up. Ooh, okay. High Council Executive Summary. Negotiations, negotiations with representatives from Zero Dawn have concluded, and I am exponentially pleased that we've arrived at a mutually profitable agreement. It shows that sugar usually goes down better than salt, in contrast to the less tactful recommendations of certain of our more reactionary members. In short, Far Zenith will provide a copy of the prototype Homer archive already sent, 500 ectogent, ectogent chambers to be retrieved from storage at our NEMA facility, supplementary ectogenesis research ports, reports. In exchange, Far Zenith will receive a copy of the alpha build of Apollo database. <gasps> Apollo was destroyed by Ted. I wonder if we can get that back. That's all the knowledge of the human freaking race. 
that would go a big way about rebuilding everything, everyone. Uh, in the week prior to the Odyssey's launch, by our estimate of Zero Dawn's timeline, by then it should be a near-complete repository of human knowledge. It should be noted that Dr. Sobek was very reluctant to agree to this, but I drew a line in the sand, making it clear that this was a non-negotiable term. As our faithful media representative, I will continue to run all public communications with Dr. Sobek's team. And then data I'll corrupted. keep an eye out for more data. Ooh, please. I miss things all the time. Let's see. Huh. A lot of glyphs. I'll tuck this away to study later. Good. It'd be nice someone else trying to help us with these. Looks like we've got to climb up. Oh. I'm not out of the way back. Lots of ways back. In case of death, maybe? Mm -hmm. Suspicious. That or me just. You okay? Yeah. Guess we won't be going that way. Um, why can't I jump up and just do the thing? Huh. I can't jump up and use my uh, hook. Uh, huh. Oh, you are kidding me. <laughs> well, it is a thousand years old. <laughs> uh, you good? Oh, yay. Okay, he can actually follow us. Good. I mean, we kind of saw that before, but still. Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on the other side's locked. There's another one of those glowing things by the table. Let's see. More information? Anzu. Jinx. The Zero Dawn terraforming system, the brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek, empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering. An obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades Protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. A copy of Gaia. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um. Oh, uh, right. It's okay, Paul. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made by a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's more than that it's called Gaia and for a long time she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself so she made me to bring her back I'm the only one who can and this place is my last hope you once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into all mother mountain was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Oral. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. 
Uh, I've had a lot of time to figure this out. Not this and again. you will too, with the focus. But for now, the reports said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Have to be careful if we push him back too much on the um, whole goddess thing. He'll just hold on more to believing that it's huh. real. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. Hmm? A weapon. Thanks, Mom. We should keep moving. What is After this? You. Obtained frost blast sling. Blast slings launch bombs that affect large area. Oh, yeah. I never, I never got this weapon in the last game. Uh, this weapon fires frost bombs. Use them against enemies to build up to the frost brittle state. While in the brittle state, enemies are more vulnerable to uh, impact damage. Which is the most bows? Okay. Uh, frost blastling. I guess I had a normal. I did have a normal blastling. Just didn't have one that did like frost. Although it was more of just a slingshot. Down here. Whoop! Ah! Ah! I'm okay. I'm okay. I think we're almost back outside. I lost right. track of where I was for a second. Oh my gosh, it's a cobra. It's heading in the same direction we're going. Great. Crap. I could try with a new weapon on it. Ooh. I can do more damage to it while it's brittle. Gotcha. Machine couldn't take the cold. Dang. All the officer in Delvers. That did a that lot. That machine must have attacked as they tried to escape. They didn't okay. stand a chance. Chill water. Shards and this new machine muscle part thingy. Interesting. Oof, oof, oof. The acid's still live. You are accumulating acid damage. Consume a cleanse so, potion to remove negative stats. You said this I backup is the last that. hope. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months, there were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow purged them all. Was he part of Far Zenith too? No. He was worse. Looks like we can cross over here. He was part of the stupid. Of the stupid. He just... He was dumb, and he was the reason to blame for everything quite quite literally okay well let's go over there and definitely not encounter mr. scary cobra man out this way okay oh look at the water are there fish they're fish oh the sky everything is so pretty oh i'm going the wrong way um something behind the waterfall mm. 
no it's just a freaking waterfall <laughs> it looked like there was like a, a doorway or something but i am very wrong Was there a ledger over there? I don't think there was. Okay. Because I need to get... There must have been... there okay so you go across oh it's right there are you kidding me? i missed it what yeah it's a good thing i left guided mode on i'm freaking blind that or i'm just way easily distracted by pretty colors wow that big metal thing looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium Imagine oh. going up to the stars in that. Oh shit. Okay. A book. Book. A journal filled with hastily scrawled glyphs. Day one, we descended into the valley and breached the ruins. Boss always had a good sense for delve sites, and by the forge, he was right. This place is untouched. Had to knock down a few machines while we were moving on gear. gear. This is a recent one. Um, pesky things kept popping out of the ground, but otherwise we've got the whole place to ourselves. Set up a camp near the entrance. Faroof nearly jumped out of his skin when he dropped his hammer and it went clanging down the stairs. Kid's first delve, I reckon, even if he swears otherwise. He's lucky this one's above ground, at least. Day two, push farther into the ruins. Boss tested out his latest prototype, what he's calling a hook and pull. Name needs work, if you ask me. I showed Faroof a simple trick to evaluate salvage. The less it's rusted, the higher a price it'll fetch in Meridian. All in a good day. Until he insisted he saw the trees shaking across the river. Kids jumpier than a frog on hot coals. Felt the deep rumble in the dead of night. Land shake, maybe. But it's got the whole crew on edge. Boss ordered half of us to set up a second camp further in. Figures he'll pick this place clean faster if we split up. No agreements there. I think I'll set up a training dummy for Faroof. Kid can barely hold his own against a burrower. Day six. Only a few of us left. Kid didn't make it. Machine blasted him with the acid at the river crossing. You can hear it slithering outside. A few more minutes rest. Then we're going to make a run for... Yeah, they didn't make it. Damn. Okay, this thing's tough. Oh boy, I hope it's weak to frost damage. <laughs> oh, I really hope. Uh. Machines patrolling ahead. We can tag them in a focus to keep track of them. Okay, that's the plan. Just tag that one's pattern. Looks like they both have the same walking pattern. Oh crap. Oh crap. They got good vision and I am Oh, 
Aww. He was a cute little robot monster. Do I feel guilty about this? No. <gasps> okay. Is this safe? This is a very small patch. I'm safe. I'm, I'm totally safe. Is it going to turn around? Oh, no. Hell yeah. <laughs> Did not see that one. That means we're clear. How the hell was this one hiding over here? Ooh. What's in here? My question exactly. Hey, we found some keys. <laughs> or, uh, sorry, ancient chimes. Or Healy berries. Machine ripped right through the wall. That's not a good sign for us. There's a ladder in the back. Upgrade our satchel, our, uh, our ammo. No, it doesn't look like it. Not yet, anyways. And I still don't have uh, any upgrade points. So tell me something. Sona was. Really okay with you not going back to the sacred lands? As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Is she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither. <laughs> oh no. I don't know anything else in there, though. It's just that chest. I guess. Ah, so much grass. <laughs> or plants. Not and if fair. they slaughtered all those Osram, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. And they're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement, convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? We'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy! Trust me. Why we always gotta Why we always gotta go off Just on go. our own. Every damn time. Oof. More corruption. Or the blight. If I can make it to that tower, 
They should be able to find a way across to the shuttle. We have. We do. an extra bit of fun. Avoid the poison grass. Maybe I should stick to my spear for now. Save some ammo. Crap. Yes, I very much am glad that they changed the melee. It is a lot better. I very much am glad that they changed the melee. Ugh. Why can't I talk right? There's a little bit of screen flicker that I'm seeing. When I go in and out of, like, the, the um, grabbing items. So I may have to up the refresh rate on the monitor. can get me up to the tower. Oh, this is gonna be so cool. We're gonna drop a freaking space shuttle on a bunch of freaking Okay, there's a rail up there. I think I can reach it if I launch myself off that path of point. Tap to drop. Uh what about jumping? High enough. I better try this again. Huh. Tap to jump and tap X to attach to grapple points. Trap zero before reaching grapple point to launch into the air. Got it. Oh. That's fun. But that's a timing thing, and I suck at timing. Killing it. Love it. Uh, okay, here we go. Well, that sounds good. Yeah, uh-huh. Okay. Storm's getting bad. Oh boy. Oh. Oh, there were three giant machines killing Osirum and leaving acid everywhere. <sighs> Great. Great to be us. Oh, I hate it. Easy. I hate it so much. Oh. Down. I won't be able to make that jump. But there is a cable here. Maybe I can ride it to the other side. I like it. Uh... Thanks for that. Okay. Looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. I'll bet there's a control console nearby. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall. The machines right up here. Basin. I see one. Oh, 
ancient valuables box. Let's take out the machines. No machines in my way. Come here, little guy. <laughs> that did nothing. That did nothing. Alright, come here, you little robot squirrel. Just gonna give you a... An, uh... I'm going to go the other way. Try to come on, a little further in. There you go. Hell yeah. Okay, let's get that out of the way. Ooh. Okay. Okay, it's okay. Oh, no, it's not. Ow. Okay. Got this place to myself now. Not as clean as I was hoping, but it works. Where was that special? Cache. Uh, right there. Ooh. Hey. Uh, let me heal before I do anything more. We're a little bit squishy. Did I not search it? Is that why that's popping up? That's ah, nothing incredibly valuable, though. I figured since it was purple, you know, purple usually means pretty good gear or something valuable. Control console might be in there. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Okay. Time to crush those machines down below. Hopefully they're still there. Please work. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. Now, how to get up the tower? We can't just shoot the cables from here with our really sad bow. <laughs> Scanning with my focus could help here. If I pull that beam down, it might drop the access lift. Okay. <laughs> Dusty. Okay. Okay, so that's drops. Um, which side do I climb this? 
drop an access slip, but I'm not sure how this helps me. climb stuff now okay I, I didn't see like yellow rimming around it or anything okay up there then oh how did I not make that jump why is life sadness or we'll die. Usual stuff. This should be the right spot. There. That connector's holding the cables together. There we go. One down. What? What? One higher. Attach the second set of cables. <laughs> Scaling an ancient rickety tower with killer machines waiting down below. Maybe I was right. No turning back now. Okay, that was weird. I was stuck in a loop. Up, down, up, down. <laughs> So much for those jumps. There's the other connector. There we go. Don't move, don't move, snakes. Yes. Parkour. <laughs> Go anywhere, are you? And she missed the hard way. We need to take this thing down to get to the data center. I should stand in the weak spot. Okay, there's that weak spot. Yes. 
Damn it. Damn it. Free. Damn it. Damn it. I gotta take this thing down fast. Fast movies. Strong dead barrel. Oh. oh, my focus might find something I can use around here. Got it, got it. Oh, hell I yeah. Said it. Finally. <laughs> okay, cool. Skill point. The data oh, center should be straight massive. Ahead. Look at this thing. I guess Farrell's gonna have to find another way there. Oh, you're a gorgeous monster, aren't you? Oh, I'll be seeing you, my nightmares. Thanks for that. Oh, Farrell's okay. There was a coil blaster. This is something I could have used. Ah. I I'm Damn it. Yeah, oh well. That would have saved me some ammo and materials. Go ahead and make some of these. Okay. Varl? Once I get the backup, I can reboot Gaia. Fix the system, heal the blight. Restore Elizabeth's dream. But is it still there? Gosh, I hope so. Uh, you earned your first skill point. Skill points are gained by leveling up and completing quests and activities. Choose a skill tree. Tap X to open it. Skip the tutorial. We don't really need it. Okay, warrior. Let's see. Progress in the story to unlock. Okay, so I guess Hunter is the one we have to go for, since the other one was locked. Concentration! Hell yeah. Sweet. Ooh, and you unlock all three of these connecting ones and you get ranged master. Bolster your resolve and deal more damage with ranged weapons for a limited time. Ooh, that's cool. Open. Okay, I should find the server room. Oh, look at the light. Look at the reflection. It's so pretty. <laughs> uh. Oh. Ooh. Close. I have to be. This looks way more familiar. Ooh. Data point. What to do about Dalgard? Uh, data corrupted. On to the matter of Mr. Dalgard. He's been a valuable member of Far Zenith for years. Even Peter saw the need for a polished folks per spokesman to preserve anonymity for the rest of us. But with all the new members we recruited to increase funds for the Odyssey's expedited timeline, 
There are simply not enough berths on the ship to accommodate. Cuts have to be made, and let's face it, Oswald lacks the skill set for our future aims. He'll retaliate if we exclude him, of course, so we'll have to give him a proper send-off. But that doesn't mean that his usefulness must end. We have plenty of source material to generate a digital puppet, giving us the means to data corrupted. Holy crap! There's some evil shit going on. Yeah, I found someone keys. I am the key master. Please be here. Nah, that'd be too easy. Reach for the stars. <laughs> it's here. No way. Gaia version 6.9. Initializing. Hello. Hi. Elizabeth? What? What? Travis Tate. Now, what's this we got here? A Farzine's conspiracy to steal a copy of Gaia? And her subordinate functions? Naughty, naughty. Oh, no. You want me to handle this, Liz? Oh, Blast no. Blasphemers, brood of vipers, with a mighty hand I smite and pour troubles upon you. Crap. Oh, shit. Thou shalt not steal. Super advanced terraforming system. Oh, are you kidding me? No copy of guy you stole, you losers. But it's the mother of all logic bombs. So good luck repairing your data. And next time you start thinking you can outsmart a tape, remember my salute. I hate that guy. So freaking close. Well, he was doing his job for the hey, good guys. I guess it's not really his fault that he'd know that it would screw over goddess. humanity. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. It's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. Now what? I got it. For a lot. I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know. But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. <laughs> the thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. <laughs> I'm out of leads, Farl. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farl. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Varl. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. Okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. No way, we're headed back? Actually... I've got a better idea. <laughs> awesome.
son is true. She's come back. Bless us. The savior of Meridian has returned. You earned this welcome. You saved them. Not yet. In the name of the Sun King of Vard, a royal welcome for the champion. Make way. Well, hello Girl. there. Aloy has an urgent matter to discuss. Does she? That makes two of us. I've sent forth hunters for weeks. The sun fall all the way to the sacred land, searching for you. Something happened at the spire. Come. I'll show you. Watch your step. You saved us all to be sure, but uh, we're still cleaning up the mess. It happened right after the solstice. We were able to explain it away, thank the sun. Otherwise, it might have caused a panic. Is it? Well, what the hell is that? What the hell is that statue? <laughs> One night, for less than half a minute, it glowed an angry red. From Meridian, it looked like a trick of the light. But those who were closer, atop the light, said it could not have been a reflection. Much to my dismay, they said the light rose up from the tower's base. From that. We left everything just as it was. What do you think happened? I don't know. The Spire's supposed to send out signals, messages, for the terraforming system. But Hades tried to use it to wake up ancient war machines. I was sure I got the connection to that thing. Wait here while I check it out. Let us know cut. what you find. Cutting people off. Can we retrieve our spear? That'd be great. It was a but good I spear. I about this. I don't know. Looks the same as before. Hmm. I could pull this thing out of the box. What? Nice. Transmission. Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Oh my gosh, did Silas... That's why he gave us the spear. That's why he gave us the spear. It wasn't because it was an upgrade or it was better. It was because... It was a Wi-Fi router. Maybe I can jump to that ledge behind me. Uh, use R to move the camera to look around type without touching either stick. Oh, okay. Simple tap of the button, eh? It was a transmitter. It had to have been, right? Oh, okay, here we go. to jump to the side. Ah, okay. Backwards, just a tap. Side, angle, and tap. Ah. Ooh. There we go. Now, how to cross over to the spire.
There we go. Able to get up there now. Holy I thought crap, we're actually when he gave me his lens. <laughs> yep. Looks like he tricked me. He transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? Why would he do that? Well, if I can figure out where he sent it, I can track him down. Oh, I can't believe we're climbing this thing. Top will tell me. Uh, looks like this panel's ajar. Can I go up through? So cool. An elevator? Let's see. They'll probably revere you more as a magical person. Finally figured it out. Ass. To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You raped the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't take one of those guy backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Eloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, now why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, I'll come find you, all right. Yes. Well, the coordinates should make it simple enough. Even for you. Oh man, you're twice the asshole you were before. <laughs> Sarcastic bastard. we look at this uh, uh, is that a statue of me yeah that's new dang I guess I should be flattered by the statue it feels wrong Especially when my job's only half done. It's cool though. You you saved people. But yeah, the, the, being the focus of so many people is kind of you know probably. I, I can't imagine, but it's probably awkward. You went inside it, and it transformed, almost like the day of the battle. I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day. Few will have seen the tower change from Meridian. What did you discover? Hades. The danger didn't end here. It went into the Forbidden West. And I have to follow. Interesting. See? That can be difficult. 
The West is called Forbidden for a reason. A tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it. The Tanakh, and they allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated. And indeed, the next embassy will take place in a day or two on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. Great, just what I need. More killers. Ah, the Sun King. We're not really great at diplomacy. Aloy, it's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now, please? It's a min. Quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace. But I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. Uh, Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Uthit. Vanasha. Quick. Better hand them over before she runs off again. Really? Must you? Ah, new toy. Holy crap, look at it. Try it on. Fancy hat. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. That's his little brother. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. Oh man, look at that thing. <laughs> Hell yeah. To learn more about the characters in the past, navigate to the character bio section I of your notebook. I need to attach the master override to my new spear. There should be a workbench around here I can use. Teen champion spear. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, um, I am interested because... Okay, uh, silence, bleh. Flames, Marat, I know you. Sun King of Ad. Vanasha, Karta Spy. Karta Spy, Vanasha met Aloy. Oh, by the... Oh, yeah, yeah, I know, I remember. Once a loyal captain of the dissident Shadow Karja, Uthid, soon discovered and exposed the corruption of its ruling priests and generals in return. They put a price on his head. Okay, I met her. I don't remember him that well. Okay, uh... You can toggle visibility of Aloy's headpieces in the general selection menu. Okay. Probably do that in a bit. Let's go say hi, though. Dowager Queen Nasadi. Blessed champion. Itaman, what do you say? My humblest thanks to you, great champion, for delivering my mother and me from Sunfall, and for defending our holy city against the forces of shadow. Did I say right? You said it fine, Edmund. And you're welcome. Champion, will you teach me how to shoot like a real machine hunter? Itaman. <laughs> I, uh, I have to go on an important mission, Prince. To save the world? Something like that. But when I come back, I could give you a few tips. It would be an honor. We owe you our lives, champion. And we will not forget. May the sun light your way. Watch out for Thunderjaws, champion! Ah, that's cool! I'm glad they found their way back home. Okay, I guess we helped them. Forgot about that. Um... Looks like a memorial. To those who fell? Honoring those who fell in the Battle of the Elite. Lots of brave people defended this place from Hades. Yeah. It was bad. Okay, modify your spirit, but also talk to your friends. Uh. Yeah, let's talk to Elvad. Been a while.
The sculptor wanted something even bigger, twice the size, covered in gold and jewels. But I was quite certain you wouldn't appreciate that. You were right. I'm sorry, Avad. It's good to see you, but I can't stay long. I see. I had hoped you'd remain in the city for a time. Perhaps at the palace. Meridian's still in danger. But it's bigger than that. To put things right, I have to go west. To Noct territory. By the sun, but to Noct? Well, perhaps Murad already told you, but... After years of hostility, we've negotiated a truce. In hopes of a lasting peace. Another embassy will be held in just a day or two. Uh... When you say years of hostility, I assume you mean the Red Raids? Ah, yes. My favorite subject. I wouldn't ask if I didn't need to know. As you know, my father raided all the border tribes. The Asuram, Banuk, and Nora suffered greatly, resisting as best they could. But none fought back like the Tanakh. They rose up and assaulted our western front at Baron Light, sweeping us from their lands. Getting them to talk to us again after that was... tricky. Um, so, very, very tenuous circumstances. How did you get the Tanakh to talk again after the war? The same way I got you to talk. By giving gifts. <laughs> <laughs> the Tanakh like tiaras? <laughs> More like metals, spices, and relics looted during the fighting. We've met with them on several occasions, and the gifts seem to have eased the tension. But this coming embassy is the most important yet. The best sign we've had so far that the Tanakh want lasting peace. Good. What makes this coming embassy so special? Well, just like today, it is special because of the guest. Our delegation will meet with the Tanakh just outside Baron Light. We'll give them treasure, and they'll return a prisoner. Fashav, one of our finest soldiers. Soldier? Don't you mean raider? No. Not in this case. Fashav is my cousin. Nothing like Helis and his ilk. He joined the Western Expedition with the hopes of reining in certain excesses. But he was captured during a heroic defense of our forward base at Cinnabar Sands. And has been held ever since. Hmm. Huh. New person. Your cousin, Vashav. How long has he been a Tanakh captive? Five years. Tanakh emissaries swear he is well, but I wonder. That tribe is renowned for its brutality. How did he survive? Well, I'll know soon enough. If you see him before I do, tell him that I await him in Meridian. Where he belongs. If I see him, I will. Edelman looks happy. Well, you got him out of Sunfall. <laughs> Any what happiness he, he has, he owes to you. <laughs> he's turning into a fine young man. Which he'll need to be if he's to inherit the crown. When the crown go to a son of yours first? <laughs> yes, well. I'd have to get married for that to happen. Murad keeps throwing noble matches at me. But I find I'm always... trying to make them into someone they're not. At any rate, I never aspired to the throne, and I don't wish to sit there forever. When Edaman comes of age, I hope to step aside. Free of the crown. I might finally be able to travel the world. Who knows? Perhaps even accompany you on one of your adventures. You make it sound easy. I... Uh, I need to get going. Uh, one moment, Aloy. There's something I must ask you. Since you left, I've thought of little else. This isn't really the time. But it has to be. The way you left before, there's... 
no way to know when I'll see you again. I'm not trying to stop you or hold you back, but I need to know when your mission is over, will you return to Meridian and stay? But long enough for us to spend time to get to know each other properly, perhaps. Damn, he is trying hard. Oh shit. This is this is really a moment that I get to choose. Ah. Uh, okay. Um flashpoints offer moments of emotional choice. How Aloy expresses her pronounced per per How Aloy expresses her personality is up to you. Choose fist and Aloy will confront the challenge directly. Choose brain and Aloy will use her insight to find a clever, less obvious approach. Choose heart, and Ayla will express compassion or give voice to her deepest convictions. Uh, well, it's Aloy, and she would tactfully say no. Dude, I thought we nipped this in the bud last time. So awkward. No, now's not the time. Avad, the... The situation calls for a, a higher perspective. End of the world. The threat I'm facing endangers not just Meridian, but a lot of other places too. End of the world. A lot of innocent people. End of the world. What happens between us, it's not important. At least, not yet. You're right. I'm acting like a fool. It's supposed to be the king who calls for a higher perspective. Please accept my apology and my wishes for your success. Goodbye, Aloy. As always, our hopes ride with you. Okay, good to see you. Bye. Thank you for making things awkward again. Damn it, Avon. Ah, I still don't know if he likes Aloy or if machine carcasses. Ooh. Remnants from the Battle of the Alight. Or if he likes if he's still trying to turn Aloy into Ursa, because I thought he liked Ursa. We were almost overrun by the machines Hades controlled. But we pushed through. Freaking hate Bellabax. Uh, was there other friends that I missed? Is Aaron here? you two or you three sorry um i just want to make sure i wasn't missing any of my other friends nope looks like we're okay okay looks real good also i should avoid staring directly into the sun where is this oh it's up there Here. Savior. Uh, and to see you in good health. Thanks. Bye. Probably shouldn't have gone this way, there. but the workbench. That way it would have been easier, but oh well. Ah, here's our other friends. This is mine though. Th this this is mine. What do you like to know? Uthid, Fanasha. Thanks for being here. Wouldn't miss it. Even if you did leave us hanging after the big battle. Vanasha, stop. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment. But I see that look on her face. She's got business to attend to. And it isn't in Meridian. You know, I didn't vanish before because I wanted to. I had... No, Huntress. Please. You don't have to justify yourself to us. You saved our butts. If you've got to go, go. With our blessing. Always. Uh, thanks. How you been? You both look like you're doing well. Mr. Shiny Pants here is now the Sun King's senior military advisor. That means people actually have to listen to him talk. May the sun bless their sorry souls. <laughs> At least I say something of substance every once in a while. What was that? I just fell asleep while you were talking. <laughs> and how about you, Vanasha? 
I've been looking after Nasadi and Edaman, two parts bodyguard, one part... Bad influence. Huh. I was gonna say nanny, but I like your version better. <laughs> uh... I never pictured you as a nanny. Edaman must be special. Hold on now. I'm not entirely domesticated. Nasadi was the mad Sun King's wife. She has enemies. I've had to foil a plot or two. Right. You can try to hide it, but inside, you're as soft as a silk pillow. Oh, you have no idea. Huh? Oh, dear. Uh, <laughs> we were talking about Edaman? <laughs> yeah. Okay, I admit it. Edaman's cute. He's fun. And he looks up to me. I like him. Except when he forgets to wash his hands after hooking worms in that muddy garden behind a solarium. Blech. <laughs> it's been months since I was in Sunfall. What's become of the Shadow Karja? <laughs> after you wiped out the Eclipse, there were hardly any priests or officers left to terrorize the little people. Abad offered amnesty to all who were forced to serve the Shadow. So the commoners cleaned out the Citadel and handed it back to him. The Sundom was unified. Avad wanted Uther to take command of the garrison there, but Captain Cudley here refused. Rumor has it that he wanted to stay close to me here in Meridian. <laughs> That's nonsense, of course. <laughs> okay. Cool, cool. You guys are adorable. Well, I, I know. I know. You're out. Go! Away with you. Always an honor, champion. Always a pleasure. But please, little Huntress, come back someday and tell us about your adventures. If I can't get in trouble, at least I can hear about yours. Aw, friends, friends, friends. We have friends. Where's Aaron? Aaron's the only one that's missing. Okay, let's see. Spear upgrade. Installs the Master Override and new module to enable the buildup and release of kinetic energy in combat. Requires the Resonator Blast skill to use. Ah, there we go. Okay, Master Override installed. Plus, something new to store up and release energy. Uh, Resonator. Should help in a fight. 